My hockey. What do you need help with? Mama, what do, you, what do you have? Candy. Oh, a piece of candy. Okay. Oh, you want candy? Okay. What do you say? Peace, Mama. So Grayson has gotten a little addicted to candy lately. I have it out and he knows where I keep the candy bag now. And so he will just walk around holding the candy bag and then he'll pick one out and bring it to me and say, Mama, fix it. Mama, fix it. What do you say? Thank you. That's right. You say thank you. Hi, Felix. What are you up to? Okay, silent treatment. Good morning, you guys. I have chocolate on the camera. That is not good. <laughs> it is Sunday morning and we got a ton of snow last night. Um, let me see if I can show you guys. It, I think we got about three to five inches. I really don't know how much and I really can't tell. But the road looks miserable. I'm glad I'm not driving on it because I hate driving in the snow. If you know me, you know. I hate driving in the snow. I hate driving in the rain. I hate driving in like, anything that's not just like clear weather <laughs> but anyway i'll show you guys after it focuses here we go so here is the snow outside it looks really pretty right now our neighbors just snow plowed their driveway we are not doing that <laughs> but yeah we got a ton of snow it just snowed all night it started snowing at about um 10 p.m last night and snowed like all night and into this morning. The reason I say that we're not gonna plow our driveway is because, well, one, Anthony's not here, and usually he would be doing that, and I'm busy with the kids, but two, it's all gonna melt because it's supposed to start raining and rain all day today. So even though we got three to five inches of snow last night, it's gonna rain, it's supposed to be heavy rain all day today, and it's gonna melt all the snow supposedly we'll see if it happens but supposedly that's what's supposed to happen okay sorry he brought me another piece of candy oh my goodness i'm gonna have to hide it now because he knows where it is and he keeps bringing me bringing me more candy I'll just put this in the candy jar sorry i'm so sidetracked this is what happens when i have gray and i have a smudge on my lens i am all over the place i'm so sorry anyway yeah so we're supposed to it's supposed to rain all day and then it's supposed to turn to snow tonight and then snow all night tonight again and we're supposed to get like another one to three inches. It's just ridiculous how much snow we have. But in Ohio, February is our snowiest month. I don't know how it is where you all are, but in Ohio, it's February. That's where we get the most snow. And it's already proving to be true. Porter's napping right now. Grayson is digging in the recycling bin, like he usually does. At least it's not the trash, I guess. He, of course, has his dinosaur boots on, which he always does. He either has these dinosaur boots on or he's got another pair over here that he wears as well. I think he likes wearing those boots because they're the only shoes that he can like get off and on by himself because all he does is like slip them on and off. But he really likes it. But today is pray for me. Hopefully the last day that this guy is in diapers. Yes, you heard me right. We are going to do potty training round two starting tomorrow. So it has been over half a year since I last tried potty training Grayson. If you were with me this long, back in July, I, like right after the 4th of July holiday, I decided to try and potty train Grayson. I read books that said that around two and a half is a good time to start potty training even if you could do it a little before two and a half that's even better and so july um was great and i really wanted to get grayson potty trained before porter came um and i had two kids to worry about and so i read books i did research i did everything i could to prepare myself and i just went for it and i failed miserably go back and watch my vlogs if you want to because i failed miserably um, it started off okay, and then it just like never made any progress. He peed all over the carpet. He pooped all over. Um, he just was not ready. I was trying to push him into something. Sorry, I'm walking away from Grayson so you don't have to hear him. I was trying to push him into something that he just was not ready for. 
and it just failed. Failed miserably. Now, Grayson is two months away from turning three, and they say that, you know, boys are later, late starters than girls, and they take longer, and I've heard from a lot of people that usually three, age three is when they've potty trained their kids. He just got accepted into preschool, so he is starting that in the fall, and he must be potty trained to attend preschool. So that is our hard deadline, but our soft deadline, what I really would like is by age three. I've read lots of books and articles that say that after age three they get a lot harder to potty train because they become three nagers and they are a lot more independent and they don't want to like follow directions and listen to you he is following me with this calendar gray don't rip it don't rip it he my mom gave me this free calendar and he is obsessed February. yes february he's very into the months of the year right now Yes, Dakota's birthday. Anyway, I think now is a good time. We're not going anywhere hardly ever because it's cold outside and COVID. And I'd really like to get this done before he turns three, before it gets warm outside, we won't go to the park every day, and before preschool. So I decided let's start February 1st. That's tomorrow, today's last day in January. And so we're gonna try again. Pray for me, pray for me, pray for me. I like literally want to cry thinking about trying to potty train him again because I just don't want to fail again. I just don't want to have to keep trying to do this over and over and over again. Like I just want it to be done. Like he is so smart. He has entire books memorized. He has to catch on potty training, right? I don't know, I'm really worried about it. He doesn't really tell me when he's peeing. Sometimes he'll tell me when he's pooping, but lately he's just been waiting until nap time to poop. So I'm really worried that he's still not ready for it, but he needs to be. I'm pushing him into it again. Maybe it'll backfire on me. So anyway, things I'm doing different this time. Last time when I potty trained him, all I did was give him M&Ms as a, a reward and he really didn't seem that into it. So I changed it up and this time I have stickers that I got off of Amazon and so we're going to have him get a sticker. He can either put it on himself or I have sheets of paper that I'm going to hang in, on the walls and he can put a sticker on the wall. And then I also have cookies. I have Oreo cookies and then I also have chocolate chip cookies. Um, the ones that are like, all you do is put them in the oven and they bake. So I have those as well. So every time he goes pee, I'll give him a cookie and a sticker. And so I think that'll be more enticing for him. I'm also gonna, starting like first thing tomorrow morning when we get up, I'm gonna take him in the bathroom with me. I'm gonna go to the bathroom. He'll, he'll be in the bathroom with me. I, and then I'll show him like, look, mama gets a sticker. Look, mama's getting a cookie. And hopefully that'll like make him like, Oh, I want one too, and hopefully that'll make him pee. I don't know. I'm also going to do a timer, so I'll set it on like our Alexa or something, and every 30 minutes I'll have it go off, and then we'll go sit on the potty. He does seem more receptive to sitting on the potty. Last time he wouldn't even want to sit on the potty most times, so he does seem more receptive to that. So hopefully he'll be able to sit, and then hopefully he just will get it kind of quickly i'm still gonna do the naked thing like i'm not gonna have any clothes on him or maybe i'll have a shirt on him um so i probably won't vlog very much of him just because i want to respect his privacy but i'll definitely keep you guys updated i'm also gonna i think i'm gonna keep the potty in the bathroom just to show like this is where we go to the bathroom instead of just care like last time i carried his little potty around with us everywhere and it worked because like he would pee so i could like quickly get him onto a potty but i don't think he like understood like you go somewhere to go to the bathroom, I guess. I don't know. This is like a super long explanation, but I'm just gearing up. We're gonna start tomorrow. We're gonna hit the ground running. I'm nervous to do it with Porter because there's gonna be times where I have to leave Grayson alone to go put Porter down for naps. And I'm not sure how that's gonna go. I guess I'm just gonna have to wing it, but this is something I really need to do. Gray, show me your calendar. Can you say the months of the year? Say January. What's next? February. What's next? March. March. What's next? April. April. May. May. June. June. July. July. August. August. September. 
October. October. November. 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 No, December. December. You guys, he is so smart. He has Who all the months of the year memorized. What's that? What is that? It's a calendar. <laughs> There's flowers on the calendar. <laughs> he is so smart, you guys. He already has all the months of the year memorized. <laughs> also, he got <laughs> some new books. My mom also got Grayson this counting book, which he is super into. She just got it off Amazon. And he also got Chicka Chicka Boom Boom, which he has the whole thing memorized, mostly because it's a song. One, two plus one equals... Two plus one equals... Three. Three. One plus three equals... One plus three equals four. Four. D plus two equals Two plus five equals seven. seven. Porter is up from his nap and he's got his new teether toy, Sophie the giraffe, and he really enjoys playing with her. Oh, where are you going? This is what he does when he's like, okay, I'm done, out of here, bye. What do you think of this toy? He's like, what's that? He loves this thing. He will laugh at it. I think he likes the squeaker on it. He's like a dog. He just ate all of his baby cereal. He's actually been doing really good with that. Where are you going? Look at him, you guys. Yum. We can see one tooth coming in on the top, which is interesting because when Gray got his teeth, his first teeth were his two bottom two teeth. Oh wow. He hasn't pooped like in a week you guys and then he pooped today and this is now his third time pooping. Are you pooping? Life of a baby.